The Concerned Nigerians Group and the Northern Youth Council of Nigeria have commended the Ninth Senate for rejecting the nomination of Loretta Onoche as the National Commissioner of the Independent National Electoral Commission. On Tuesday, the chairman of the committee, Kabiru Gaya, said in his report that Onoche did not satisfy the provision for the federal character principles. Concerned Nigerian groups in a statement by its spokesperson Theophilus Abo Agada commended this move by the Senate. He noted that the nomination of Onochi, a member of the ruling All Progressive Congress and Special Assistant to the President as INE Commissioner, is an aberration and mockery of Nigeria's democracy. We commend the Nigerian Senate for showing extraordinary courage in rejecting the nomination of Onoche as INEC Commissioner. INEC is an independent institution and the candidacy of Onoche you know, negates the principle upon which the body was established. Onoche is not you know, just partisan. She has proven over time to be a paid hack of the ruling party her democratic actions in defending the president and politicians elected on the platform of the ruling or progressive party you know or progressive congress pardon will affect a sense of judgment in discharging her duty as an INA commissioner the group said the group stated that an INA commissioner ought to be someone with no you know questionable character but with you know proven integrity it also urged president muhammad buhari to sign the amendment electoral bill to strengthen nigerians electoral process and ensure transparency and credibility in elections if the president means well for nigeria and he is concerned about the quality of leaders elected into different offices he should sign the amended electoral bill rather than appointing an aid for questionable integrity that will help him and his party rig elections. In the same vein, we call on the National Assembly not to reverse the gain we have made in electoral process by banning the electronic transmissions of results. The ruling All Progressive Congress succeeded in 2015 in assuming power because of the innovative introduction of a card reader the national assembly must continue to support creative ideas by INEC which will help the commission conduct free credible and transparent elections finally we called on the inspector general of police to begin immediate you know prosecution of loretta onochi for brazilian lying on the oath the Northern Youth Council of Nigeria also lauded the Senate's rejection of the nomination of Onoche, describing it as a victory for democracy and confirmation of the independence of the National Assembly. In a statement by its president, Issa Abubakar, the group stated, those who badly cancelled President Buhari to make such nomination had better desist from misleading him or risk facing the anger of northern youths. The council admonished the leaders of the National Assembly and other legislative wings to continue to put Nigeria's democracy first above party and individual sentiments. It said, without democracy, the Senate, the Senate President, pardon, would have been handling chokes in the classroom or Mr. Speaker would have been busy in the court without the hope of occupying the sensitive position democracy afforded them. This also applies to other members of the National Assembly. The group further urged them to ensure that they safeguard democracy for the future generation so that their children will benefit from it too. What is your thought about this? What is your reaction to this that we have had? We have heard about you know the concern nigerian group and the northern youth council of nigeria who have commended the ninth senate for rejecting the nomination 
of Loretta Onochi as a national commissioner of the independent you know, National Electoral Commission. What is your thought about this? On Tuesday, the chairman of the committee, Kabiru Gaja, you know, said in his report that Onochi did not satisfy the provisions of the federal character principles. What is your thought about this? We would like you to drop your thoughts in reaction to this with what we have had. It is obvious that, you know, we have been seeing some positive changes in our democracy and we hope all this will just continue so that we could be able, you know, to choose the right person for sensitive positions like this. Well, we would like you to drop your thoughts and comment via the comment section on this that has been said. But before we go, let's see people's reactions and know their thoughts about this. Let's see what people have felt concerning, you know, the present situation of things. Amechi Kenneth reacted to this and said, her case should be a case study for others. She was only, you know, the woman in APC talking about, you know, series of things and was talking from both sides of the mouth. What is your thought about this? What is your reaction to what Amechi has said? That the case of this woman should be a case study for others. She was the only woman in APC talking from both sides of the mouth. And CJ Nwoye also reacted to this and said, And we thank the Senate for rejecting her. We have long rejected her too. Let her enjoy her shame alone. What is your thought about this? We can see that people are happy, you know, with the Senate for what they have done for rejecting her because most, you know, most people in their hearts does not even want, you know, somebody like her. There are some people who believe that she cannot represent you know the post very well so people are not even happy seeing her you know being nominated so they're happy with what has been done by the senate for rejecting her what is your thought about this do you think people are rejecting her just because she's not from the north do you think if probably she comes from the north probably president muhammad Buhari would have find a way of getting her the post do you think that is possible even if the people of nigeria are not you know you know they are not willing to have her in that post. I'd like you to drop your thoughts about this that has been said. We'd like you, you know, to share your own point of view and reaction to this. Abubi Ben reacted to this and said, To God be the glory. Senate, for the first time, I stand with the senators. You can see that people are happy with the step of which the Senate have taken with what they have done. But Razor reacted to this and said, If she was from the northern you know part if she is a you know northern candidate they would have stood in solidarity for her like they did for pantami everywhere in nigeria is full of hypocrisy what is your thought about this that if she's a northern candidate they would have stood in solidarity for her just like they did for pantami everything is just hypocrisy what is your thought about this we would like you to drop your thoughts and comment via the comment section on this as we said like you to share your own point of view and what you felt about the northern youth who have commended the senate for the rejection of Anochi as the INEC commissioner. Thank you guys for listening. To subscribe to this channel if you have not, and I'll see you on the other news. Bye for now.